Snapchats. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'll be doing a first impressions video of the um, Milky Piggy Carbonated Bubble Clay Mask. And I picked this up through Amazon and I ordered it a couple weeks ago and I finally got it in. Um, I'll leave a link down below of where I got it and the actual seller. But I've been wanting to try this kind of mask before because I've seen a lot of it on YouTube and a lot of people have tested this one out and um, my face just needs a little bit extra help. I don't know if you guys can tell but I just got out of the shower not too long ago. That's why there's nothing on my face and I look a little bit crazy but um, yeah. So if you guys want to see a first impression of this product, go ahead and keep on watching this video. So I don't really have any headbands or anything like that near me. I don't know where they actually went. I think I lost them. So I'm just using my Minnie Mouse one that I got from Disneyland. And I washed my face. I'm not too sure if you're supposed to wash your face before or anything like that. Because everything is in Korean. Nothing is in English. And I'm a little bit too lazy to go ahead and research it. And also this one is also cruelty free because there's a little bunny in the back. But I went ahead and took it out of the... Um, box obviously so it'll be a little easier and oh my god it's so messy it's like coming out from the sides can you see that so it comes with a little spatula I guess to apply I don't have any tables in front of me so it's a little hard and I'm going to try and make this not so messy. Ah! So gross. Oh my god. Can you see that? So I'm going to go ahead and use this spatula that it comes with. And this is how it looks like. It's like gray goop. So I'm going to go ahead and apply maybe just that much. Spread this throughout my face. I'm not too sure if you're supposed to use your hands with the spatula. You know what? I'm ditching the spatula. I'm just gonna use my fingers. A lot faster. Oh my god. The feeling of it is really hard to describe. Like it feels like foam already, but not really. Oh my god, it's so cool, but it's so weird. Okay, so I think you're I think you're supposed to leave it on for like five minutes and it starts to bubble up, but I'm gonna zoom you guys in, and it's already pretty much bubbling up. So, um, I don't have a cloth, but let's go ahead. Right now it is eight eleven. And I'm going to wait until 8.16. But I'm going to keep the camera on so you guys can see the process. So it's been two minutes so far. I'm going to zoom you guys in a little bit closer. You guys can see that it's pretty much bubbles. Like, that. <laughs> And it's going on my nostrils. It's almost been five minutes, but I figured I'd go ahead and tell you guys my skin type because I don't think I announced that earlier in this video when I should have. Uh, my skin type is normally really, really oily and acne prone, but lately my face has been pretty dry where like my face starts to peel and even if I moisturize or use like sheet mask to like help moisturize my skin, it just gets really, really dry. I really think it's the birth control that I'm on that's making my face change and like, there's a lot of texture to it. But I think this mask is supposed to be for all skin types. I'm not too sure. I do know that the charcoal is supposed to help um, deep clean your pores. 
Also, I wanted to let you guys know that in the box that it was sent, I still have this all over my hand. They did give me some samples of like whitening serums and serums to help deep clean your pores. So that was really nice. And I think this mask retails for about eight nine dollars and it was free shipping so yeah right now it's 8 16 you can't really see that because my phone is super dim but i'm gonna go ahead and just oh my god can you guys hear that oh this is so cool i'm gonna rub it in oh oop because you're supposed to do that after that's done so i'm gonna go ahead and do that the whole face and then I'm gonna go ahead and rinse this off now and I'll be right back alrighty so I went ahead and washed it all off as you can see um, it was a little bit hard to take off the mask because it kind of clung to my skin and whenever you would like um, just kind of rub it up like this like how you would with a wash um, it just sudded, suds up a lot is that the right word to use it just came really really bubbly like you had a lot of soap on your face so that took a while to um, rinse off but my face just feels really nice and smooth it does feel like I tightened the pores around my nose and my pores around here where I have large pores um, my nose feels really really smooth as if I used like one of those strips but I didn't um, let me see yeah, my skin just feels really, really nice. I think it looks pretty good on camera. I don't have perfect skin, but I think it looks pretty, pretty good. Um, what else? It didn't over dry my face or anything like that. It just feels really nice and clean. It does feel a little bit tight, but not drying tight, if that makes any kind of sense. But yeah, um, overall, I do really like this product. I am going to continue to try it out. I normally like to do a mask every week, normally at least once or twice a week. So I'm going to go ahead and incorporate this into my normal face routine when I do use mask and everything like that. And just wanting to treat myself. But yeah, if you guys have any questions about the product I picked up, I just picked it up from Amazon and that will be linked down below. If you guys have any questions or anything like that, go ahead and leave them in the comments in down bar around there. And if you guys like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, click on the subscribe button so you guys are notified of future videos from me. And go ahead and leave requests down below as well so I know what kind of videos you guys want to see. I hope you guys like the videos that I've been putting out. I've been a little bit more active on my channel recently, just kind of been more motivated to be into my normal YouTube um, filming thing so yeah i hope you guys like this video if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up and i'll see you in my next one bye